this year we have six um, awesome bobbleheads featuring three of our top young players, uh, Josiah Gray, CJ Abrams, Caber Ruiz, and then two of them will be our beloved mascots. We are doing uh, two racing president bobbleheads. Each one will feature two of our racing presidents, and it's kind of a get the first one, make sure you come back and get the second one um, as they are running across the finish line together. Our Star Wars Day is back May 20th. Um, we are doing the Hawaiian shirts, light side versus dark side. And then we are very, very excited as we are having Harry Potter Day this year, July 8th. Um, fans can receive one of the four house scarves. We show, that's kind of our phrase that we're gonna use this year because the fans and community show up for us and we show up for them. Then we have our fedora that we'll be giving out later in April and then a commemorative mug in September at the end of the season. So we've reformatted our concession stands this off season, uh, making it easier to grab your food and get back to the seat. So our fans are gonna, in most locations, they're gonna grab their food off a heat slide. They're gonna go right over to a uh, kiosk, check themselves out. Our staff is there making sure that there's fresh food on that heat slide constantly, but also fulfilling beverage orders. So together with our staff focusing on the food and beverage portion of it, and our fans focusing on grabbing that item and checking themselves out, we can get fans back to their seats much faster. Yeah, so you're gonna see an entirely new lineup, uh, uh, plus the classics. So with our City Connect program, we've expanded that so to be not just on-field items, but you know casual wear as well as leisure pieces. We have wear by Aaron Andrews and Therese coming in, both women-owned and women-focused brands. I think there's always been a lot of feedback about we have so many uh, women who are fans, but they want gear that's made for them. And so we working with Major League Baseball and getting the right vendors in here, we've added two new there. Uh, you'll see more items from the Peter Millars and Johnny O's of the world, uh, really making sure that we're covering all of our fans coming into the building. Uh, we have uh, our, our new uh, Cuban cigar, has a key lime aioli. It's, it's essentially a uh, mojo turkey with pickles, pork, and shredded cabbage with uh, a, like, a nice key lime drizzle. So we have all new offerings from the, the local DMV area. I infuse a little of the DMV flavor into my cooking um, and just elevate it up a notch. It's more or less like a, a DMV crab cake. No filler, just all base, all lump crab meat. Um, and yeah, it's good to go from there.